Excellent. Jason from the Wine Company. We have a bottle of the Wine Company Bubbly. Just to be able to show you exactly how to open up a bottle correctly so you're not injuring yourself or making a big mess out of things. So what I like to do just to make sure that I'm going to be in good shape is I keep my thumb on the very top of the bottle there. Every once in a while a bottle, a cork will just blow out completely on its own. So you're going to take this and actually it's a lawn champagne, seven half turns. How's that for trivia? So we'll open that up like that. And this is what I do personally. I keep my thumb on top there just to make sure that big accident isn't going to happen because this can be dangerous. I keep my hand right up on top and then hold on to the cork tight and then twist the bottle. It works out a little bit better than trying to twist the cork. Twist the bottle slowly and you get that nice gentle release. Blowing the cork off aggressively sometimes will make it foam up a little bit too much. You might get spilled all over your hands. You don't want to do that, especially with a bottle of real champagne. And then serve it from there. What I like to do is I grab it, oops, grab it, pour it at an angle into the glass. That way you're not going to lose too much of the bubbles. And voila, that's how you do it correctly.